folks. I spend so much time chipping away at the huge icebergs of news, but sometimes I like to scrape up all the little ice shavings and mix them into my frozen news margarita of a segment. Meanwhile. <laughs> Meanwhile's back. When it's not on, they miss it. Everyone loves Meanwhile. <laughs> Meanwhile. According to a new survey, online shopping while drunk may be worth billions to the U.S. economy. I am sure that's true. I happen to have personal knowledge that drunk shopping has been worth thousands to the Golden Girls Beach Towel Etsy store. I can't stop. There's a different towel for every episode. According to one report, last year, Americans spent nearly $40 billion while drunk, and a shocking amount of that went to food. Why is that shocking? I'll tell you what would be shocking. Shocking is if someone drunk saved for their kid's future. <laughs> Honey, uh, last night I hit the booze with Daryl and we allocated 6% of our savings to a 529 college fund. I just... <laughs> we were animals. Now, among... <laughs> also, among the most popular items purchased while under the influence were clothing and shoes with movies and games as the next most popular, and the third most popular was... Blick McCurry, I miss Becky. <laughs> Meanwhile, I do, Becky. Meanwhile, we all know there are crazy, outdated laws on the books, but good news, it's now legal to have sex before marriage in Utah. <laughs> okay? <laughs> yes, bravo. <laughs> so, just, okay, so now you can have sex before your wedding, and after your wedding, but be advised, it is still considered rude to have sex during your wedding. <laughs> Meanwhile, details are starting to leak about the Cats movie. The first detail, uh, there's gonna be a Cats movie. <laughs> now, Cats is a tough one to adapt. For one thing, it's famously very light on narrative. It's basically like watching an actual cat, okay? <laughs> okay, why are you screaming at the door? Do you want to go out? The door's open, just go. Okay, now you're licking your butt. I cannot follow <laughs> the plot of this story at all. And this thing is going to be star-studded. To play the titular cats, they've got Taylor Swift, Judy Dench, and Idris Elba. And the director will use performance capture to make his actors look like they have real fur on them. So congratulations <laughs> to the one guy whose fetish is Judy Dench as a furry. <laughs> your patience has paid off. That is... Still very attractive. Still very attractive. <laughs> Meanwhile, speaking of animals doing people stuff, a hotel in England has started offering yoga with lemurs as partners, <laughs> which might be fun for the people, but I think I've been in the emotional state this lemur's in right now. <laughs> oh, my God, this is boring. I am... I'm here because my wife wanted to do this. She said this was a resort. Stop pretending you know Sanskrit. Just say, do a push-up. <laughs> Don't ask me about my flow. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, uh. Amsterdam is opening a 5D porn cinema, which aims to please all five senses. <laughs> finally! Finally, something for all those people who watch porn and think, mmm. I'd love to smell that. <laughs> and... <laughs> the theater has a 3D screen, as well as motion seats, air jets, and water cannons <laughs> that all move or fire in time with the action. Have no desire to see that? Too bad, Jim. <laughs> What is that supposed to simulate? <laughs> Getting it on while off-roading through a mud puddle in a convertible Jeep? <laughs> According to the owners, after the experience, you're left energized. You want to get back out there, have a beer or a coffee and talk and process what just happened. <laughs> maybe, maybe take a shower, squirt some Purell in your eyes. <laughs> Burn your clothes, you know. <laughs> process. Meanwhile, an Italian manufacturer is making an attempt at introducing stand-up airplane seats. 
Here's one of the few things I know about seats. If you're standing, not a seat. <laughs> I am... I'm looking forward to next year's innovation in cramming more of us into airplanes. The pile. <laughs> no boarding groups, no classes, no seat belts. After that, they'll just arrange the passengers into a human Santa plane. <laughs> oh, you'd like some honey roast peanuts? Just wait. <laughs> You'll definitely want to be in first class. We'll be right back with Santa.